another white woman and I'll be stuck with the children. So in my head, it was just like that. Coming back from 2019, that's when I went to counseling and I started changing um, my mentality and everything. And then I started accepting people as friends and, you know, dating and all that. Because I wasn't dating, I wasn't doing anything because I felt like all men were bullshit. Like, all the men are stupid or something. In my head, like, all the men are stupid. Because we are a product of, of our of our back of yeah. our upbringing I and mean, there's no question but let me just put another scenario to you see if let's say your parents have stayed together because i don't believe in shoulda woulda coulda but let's just say your parents have stayed together and they weren't happy and you grew up seeing that they weren't happy and they were miserable and yes your father will probably come and pick you up but then you'll come home and not probably have a conversation with your mother they were constantly fighting. That scenario, how would that have made you feel as well? You wouldn't know. Of course. So, so I just think, you know, as I sometimes think if my father had stayed with my mother, he probably wouldn't have died early. Um, my, there's so, so, I can see so many scenarios, so many scenarios with my upbringing if the two of them were together. Um, and but I, I stopped looking at them because for me, I just believe that life is how you're dealt. And when you're dealt those cards, you have to live it. Yeah. You have to be the best you possibly can. You've taken on your mom's negativity of men and, and white women and people and whatnot. Yeah. And that was unnecessary. You know, as parents, we really shouldn't be doing that. But she was hurt. So she did what she did. Yeah. My mom made sure we hated our dad. You know, like she made sure she would say some things to you and you feel like is that really your dad did that like really he did that sometimes he would tell you stuff that he did to her and i'm like and you were there with him and he did all that to you so i didn't like my dad at all when i was a kid even though he was paying everything i didn't like him because of what my, my mom was always telling me yeah my mom, mom would tell me that because my mom wasn't was, her okay. told me after the devil my dad is the next person oh no when i was a kid yeah no. so I, growing up i felt like all oh, men are devil and oh. no I didn't like no. men at all <laughs> i know i i i so i understand yeah. listen now the pain of uh, growing up I, yeah. I i get it because there's certain things that i mean i i could tell you as well but you know i, I think we have to see about that um it's her, your mother's burden to carry yeah. it wasn't your and it, and she, she should never put that on on you but what, um and what, what i'm sad is even now they don't want to like talk as adults they don't want to have a matured conversation even